Hello everyone, this is Jeremy from Primetime Keto. Today we're coming at you with a product known as Superfat. Superfat is a nut butter that is keto, paleo, and vegan certified. There is currently six different flavors on the market. Um, they are primarily made of macadamia nuts. Uh, there are a few different variations um, where they've added like protein powder or probiotics or coffee or mint. Um, most of them range between 230 to 300 calories per pouch. Um, carbs, net carbs is three to five grams per pouch. And then fat is anywhere from 21 to 30 grams per pouch. Um, I've tried and tested all of these products out myself. So I'm just gonna talk about each one individually. The first one I wanna talk about is the coffee MCT pouch. This one is probably my least favorite. Um, as I am not an avid coffee drinker, and this tastes a lot like coffee. Um, it also is uh, extremely gritty when you're going to eat it, um, and you can. it kind of reminds me of coffee grounds in how gritty it can be. Outside of that, it supposedly has caffeine in it. I didn't feel any extra oomph when I was eating it or uh, after I had eaten it. Um, it was... Probably, it was definitely my least favorite out of all of it as well. It is our, it is sweetened, however, with uh, uh, stevia and erythritol. The next one up we have is the macadamia coconut one. This out of all, this really tastes like macadamia nut. Obviously, the title, the name of this one is macadamia coconut. It truly does taste like macadamia. I personally love macadamia nuts, so this is a good one to have for me. Um, it's not as thick and it's not as gritty um, as the coffee plus MCT one. This one, uh, even though it does have coconut in it, you really can't taste the coconut as much. Um, and it has absolutely no extra sugars, so no stevia, no erythritol. For those of people that don't like the flavor of stevia or erythritol, this one would be a good one to have because it doesn't have the same aftertaste. The next one we have is the protein blend one. This one is um, macadamia almond nut butter, um, but it also has an extra protein in it. Um, it's only one gram of extra protein, so the highest one is the Coffee Plus MCT, which is eight grams, and this one currently has nine grams in it. The protein is from sunflower, um, so it's a plant-based protein, which all of these are plant-based um, because they are vegan certified. Um, it's extremely thick with its consistency, and... Uh, you might say it's just a little bit too thick um, and it does make it extra difficult to get it on the package itself. Um, if you're trying to use the top, um, you might have to actually cut it from the side. Um, and it is sweetened with stevia and erythritol. Next one we have is the cacao coconut. This one, just like the, just like the package says, it tastes like coconut. It is definitely sweeter than the first three packages we went through. Um, it is sweetened with erythritol and stevia. Um, it's probably one of my favorite. I do like the taste of this. It's really easy to eat. Um, I'm not normally a big fan of coconut. Um, I've tried coconut oils in the past and really don't care for them, but this one is pleasantly surprising. I mean, maybe it's the sweet taste and I like a little bit extra sweeter taste when it comes to this stuff. I don't know. The next to last one is called MCT Macadamia Plus Probiotics. As the title suggests, it does taste like macadamia um, as opposed to anything else. It is infused with bacillus coagulans, which is a probiotic, which is aids in digestion. Um, and that to me is just an extra benefit for this one. Um, it's not very thick and it does not have a gritty taste, like especially like the coffee one. Um, and then lastly, we have cacao mint, cacao mint, which is, uh, probably my favorite out of all of them. This one is rather new and it, it was a special 
um, run, so I don't know if they'll keep this one. Um, but it kind of reminds me of those little mints that sometimes restaurants leave on your on your table, or you can get like the little Andes mints. I don't know if peop most people know about those. Um, it just it tastes like a chocolate mint. It's really good, um, and I really enjoy it. It is sweetened with stevia and erythritol as well. Um, and it probably is my favorite and it's probably one that I would get more often than not. Um, all these pouches can be bought either on their website or through Amazon. I personally buy them off of Amazon myself um, just because I get prime shipping. Um, the first five pouches that I did talk about, um, I did take with me to Africa for a mission that I was doing. Um, they were very, very crucial with me staying keto there because I didn't you didn't you don't have a lot of options when you're in the slum areas or anything like that to eat. So this and another product I took with me um, there and it was very great. Didn't have a problem getting across customs with it or anything like that. I did uh, place most of them in my check luggage and then place a handful in my personal bag. So I had them on the flights and stuff like that. Um, outside of that, I would recommend these for anybody who's going camping or hiking that's doing keto. Like the packages aren't that heavy and they're easily stuffed into like corners and crevices in your bag. So you would have them. Each package is a 1.5 ounce uh, package. So it is 42 grams. So those that decide to take weight into account, yeah, at least you know how much you're going to get. Um, I personally, the cacao mint in the probiotic um, along with a uh, cacao coconut one is the, are the ones that I would take with me. The MCT uh, coffee plus MCT and the protein blend one, they are there. They can be very hard to need. They will take some effort to need. And if you're trying to just grab and go, like the other ones are nowhere near as bad um, to get really back to uh, normal consistency throughout. Um, I would highly recommend them for hiking if you are a person that does keto and you need the, the nutrition, the fats, and uh, stuff to go on with. Um, if you like more of this content, please, please, uh, it would help me if you hit the like and subscribe button um, for future content like this. I plan on reviewing a lot more other products that I've used and that I plan on using in the future. Um, I've been personally been doing keto for over two years now and have lost a significant amount of weight. Um, uh, thank you. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you again. Goodbye.